Hello viewers, welcome to my channel PMCE. In this video, we are going to see the topic Addition of two four-digit numbers without regrouping. This is the first topic you will be learning in class 3 under the concept Mathematical Operations on Numbers. As this is the first topic you will be learning in class 3, we will have a quick revision of the basic concepts in addition before we start with addition of two four digit numbers. Let us go into the details of this video now to see what are the basic concepts in addition that we will be seeing initially. First, to begin with, we will be seeing addition of two three digit numbers without regrouping. Then, we will be dealing with add three three digit numbers without regrouping. Next, we will be looking into the topic add two three digit numbers with regrouping once. Next, we will be dealing with the topic add two three digit numbers with regrouping both the ones and the tens. Next, we will be dealing with add three three digit numbers with regrouping ones and tens. Then we will be taking up this topic add two four digit numbers without regrouping. Once we finish with all these topics as a quick revision, doing this final topic of adding two four digit numbers without regrouping will become very easy for the children. Let us begin with the first topic add two three digit numbers without regrouping. Here we have two three digit numbers 364 plus 623. So first write down the place values ones, tens and hundreds. Then start adding from the ones place. 4 plus 3 is 7. 6 plus 2 is 8. 3 plus 6 is 9. So 364 plus 623 will give you the answer 987. Dear viewers, as this is the first topic that we are seeing without regrouping in class 3, just for a quick revision, I am letting you know that you will have to start your addition starting from the ones place and move on towards the left. Let us do another example for the same topic. We have 175 plus 604. First write down the place values 1s, 10s and 100s and start adding from the 1s place. 5 plus 4 will give you 9. 7 plus 0 will give you the same number 7. And 1 plus 6 is 7. So 175 plus 604 will give you the answer 700. 79. Let us move on to the next topic. Add three three digit numbers without regrouping. So let us see the first example where we have 130 plus 518 plus 241. The first step in addition is to write down the place values ones, tens and hundreds. And we should start the addition with the ones place. Here we have three numbers. So for addition of three numbers, first you should add the first two numbers and add the third number to the sum of the first two numbers. You must have learned this in your lower classes. So let us first begin by adding 0 plus 8 which will give you 8 and then 8 plus 1 will give you the answer 9. Next move on to the tens place and add 3 plus 1 will give you 4 and the answer 4 plus 4 will give you 8. Move on to the hundreds place. 1 plus 5 will give you 6 and 6 plus 2 will give you the answer 8. So 130 plus 518 plus 241 will give you the sum 889. Let us do another example under the same topic. We have 256 plus 401 
plus 110. The first step is to write the place values ones, tens and hundreds. Then begin by adding the digits in the ones place. 6 plus 1 will give you 7. 7 plus 0 will give you 7. Move on to the tens place. 5 plus 0 will give you the sum 5. And 5 plus 1 will give you the answer 6. Next move on to the hundreds place. 2 plus 4 will give you 6. And 6 plus 1 will give you the answer 7. So 256 plus 401 plus 110 will give you the answer 767. Let us move on to the next topic. Add two three digit numbers with regrouping ones. Here we have two three digit numbers 366 plus 627. First write down the place values ones, tens and hundreds. Next begin by adding the digits in the ones place. So we have 6 plus 7 which will give you 13 which is a two digit number with 3 in the ones place and 1 in the tens place. So 13 can be written as 1 10 plus 3 ones. So you retain the three ones in the ones place and move the one ten as a carryover to the tens place. So you will be adding this one which is a carryover along with the other digits in the tens place. So now you will be adding one plus six which will give you seven and seven plus two will give you nine. Next move on to the hundreds place where you have three plus six which will give you nine. So, 366 plus 627 will give you the sum 993. Let us move on to the next example. 418 plus 307. First write down the place values ones, tens and hundreds. Then begin by adding the ones place where you have 8 plus 7 which will give you 15. With 5 in the 1's place and 1 in the 10's place. So 15 can be written as 1 10 plus 5 1's. So we retain the 5 1's in the 1's place and take this 1 as a carryover to the 10's place. So you will be adding 1 plus 1 which will give you 2 and 2 plus 0 will give you 2. Next move on to the 100's place where you have to add 4 plus 3 which will give you 7. So 418 plus 307 will give you the answer 725. Let us move on to the next example. Add two three digit numbers with regrouping ones and the tens place. So here we have two three digit numbers 275 plus 348. Write down the place values first ones, tens and hundreds. Then begin by adding the ones place. 5 plus 8 will give you 13 which is a two digit number with 3 in the ones place and 1 in the tens place. So 3 will be retained in the ones place and the 1 will be taken as a carryover to the other digits in the tens place. So now add 1 plus 7 which will give you 8 and 8 plus 4 will again give you a two digit number 12. So we have 12 tenths now which is nothing but 120 that is 100 plus 2 ten. So you retain the 2 ten in the tens place and take the 1 as a carry over to the hundreds place. So now you will be adding 1 plus 2 which will give you 3 and 3 plus 3 which will give you 6. So 275 plus 348 will give you the sum 623. Let us do another example to understand this concept better. We have 569 plus 385. First write down the place values ones, tens and hundreds. Begin by adding the digits in the ones place. 9 plus 5 will give you the number 14 which is having 4 in the 1's place and 1 in the 10's place which is nothing but 1 10 plus 4 1's. So retain 4 in the 1's place and carry over 1 to the 10's place. So you have 1 plus 6 which is 7 
and 7 plus 8 will give you 15. So what you do is you retain 5 in the tens place and carry over this 1 to the hundreds place. So next it will be addition of the digits in the hundreds place where you have 1 plus 5 which will give you 6 and 6 plus 3 which will give you 9. So 569 plus 385 will give you the answer 954. Dear viewers, we have many more such examples coming our way. So stay with me till the end of this video. Before that, if you like the quality of my video, please do hit the subscribe button and do not forget to tap on the bell button and choose the all option to get regular notifications of all the updates that I make in my channel. Let us move on to the topic. Add three three digit numbers with regrouping ones and tens. So we have 589 plus 173 plus 148. Begin by adding the digits in the ones place. 9 plus 3 is 12 and 12 plus 8 is 20. 0 will be retained in the ones place and 2 will be taken as a carryover to the tens place. 2 plus 8 will give you 10. 10 plus 7 is 17 and 17 plus 4 is 21. So 1 will be retained in the tens place and 2 will be taken as a carryover to the hundreds place. So 2 plus 5 is 7, 7 plus 1 is 8 and 8 plus 1 is 9. So the answer is 910. Let us do another example. 198 plus 247 plus 391. So add the digits in the ones place. 8 plus 7 will give you 15 and 15 plus 1 will give you 16. 6 will be retained in the ones place and 1 will be carried over to the tens place. 1 plus 9 is 10. 10 plus 4 is 14. 14 plus 9 will give you 23. So 3 will be retained in the tens place and 2 will be carried over to the hundreds place. 2 plus 1 is 3. 3 plus 2 is 5. And 5 plus 3 is 8. So the sum of these 3 3 are... 3 digit numbers is 836. Now let us do this topic. Add 2 4 digit numbers without regrouping. As we have covered all the previous topic, this addition is going to be very easy for us now. So we have 1276 plus 8512. Add the digit in 1's place. 6 plus 2 is 8. 7 plus 1 is 8. 2 plus 5 is 7. And 1 plus 8 is 9. So the answer is 9788. Let us do another example. 4318 plus 2071. Adding the digits in 1's place, 8 plus 1 is 9, 1 plus 7 is 8, 3 plus 0 is 3 and 4 plus 2 is 6. So the sum of these two 4 digit numbers is 6389. Let us do some more examples. Write down the place values and start adding the digits in the ones place. 3 plus 6 is 9, 1 plus 0 is 1, 1 plus 1 is 2 and 3 plus 5 is 8. So the sum of 3113 plus 5106 is 8290. Let us do this example now. 4003 plus 1092. Adding the digits in ones place, 3 plus 2 is 5. 0 plus 9 is 9, 0 plus 0 is 0 and 4 plus 1 is 5. So the sum of the two 4 digit numbers is 5095. Dear viewers, these are all the learning outcomes in class 3 under the topic addition of which we have completed this topic addition concepts revision and addition of two 4 digit numbers without regrouping in this video. Each of these topics given here will be dealt with in separate videos and links to all the relevant videos will be given below in the description box. Dear viewers, if you like my video, give a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Please do provide your valuable comments in the comment section. Thank you for watching my video. See you again.